Welcome back to this Let's Play of Fallout 3. We are in the pit, and, uh, well, we're in the Flatiator. Uh, Flatiator? The Gladiator pit. So, uh, you again. apparently we got one more fight we have to win to get our freedom, supposedly. We'll see what that actually, how that actually happens. Fight, scab. One more, and I don't get to call you that anymore. You ready? Who am I going to be fighting? You're going up against Gruber. He's one of the only slaves to win in the hole. There's only ever been, what, three? I guess he got a taste for blood. But unfortunately for you, he's got a pretty decent gun. So odds are this is the last time you and I will be talking. Mm, yeah, yeah. Well, all right. That's what you said the last two times. The people didn't even, like, lay a scratch on me, so uh, I'm not too worried about it, frankly. There's some actual armor on that guy. Undefeated in the hole, Gruber has yet to meet his match. Only one will walk out with their freedom. Only one will walk out alive. Release the barrels. Go! Well, there are barrels just hanging there. It's so random. Like how he's just getting bashed by barrels. <laughs> Gruber didn't even get to pull the trigger. All right, Gruber. You were terrible. Uh, I mean, there's no reason to keep that either. Nothing. I guess we'll keep the weapons for now. Thank you. Well now, aren't you quite the scrapper? Congratulations. You've done well. Asher wishes to see you. The guards will be told to allow you to pass. I mean, if they're, I mean, if they're not, I'll just shoot them, so... Easy. Oh. All my stuff. Was this... Oh no, re retrieve your gear from the arena footlocker. Oh. Okay, no, so because I'm not a whatever, I've got my freedom now. I guess they gave me my gear back. I'm guessing that wasn't there the whole time. I was gonna say, was that there the whole time? Dang damn it. Okay, well now let's see. Let's, uh. Well, I guess I don't want this, this junk then. Put my armor back on. Let's sell that maybe. Let's hold on to it for the moment in case we need it. Uh, blood pack, purified water, sure. Lower our, uh, let's see, let's just drop some of this stuff then, I mean. Don't need a 32 pistol, I don't need the auto axe. So are my weapons on? Oh, gosh, yeah, it re. Ugh, okay, well. All right, one thing at a time, I guess. Here, let's just drop all this junk I've got. Okay, let's see. I think I had Sydney. I had re. It took everything off, unfortunately. Rifle. Plus fishing aid. Salt rifle. Uh, probably no grenades. Sorry. And then I think we had in the seventh spot our. Stimpaks. Perfect. Okay. Um. I guess we'll use the Chinese assault rifle for right now. We can swap it out in a little bit, probably. Alright. Well, at least we get to talk to the boss, and well, frankly, we can probably just go bang and kill him. <laughs> Admittedly. The problem, well, we'll talk to him first, though, because we're supposed to get this cure, is what we're supposed to be getting. Um. Over here somewhere. Look, shut up and listen to me. You want to get out of this shithole or not? Look, I need your decision. You with us? Better don't be the slave 
than dying. What? Trying to get us both shot? Fine. This is happening. And when it does, you better stay the fuck out of my way, or I may just forget which side you're on. Oh. Whatever you need, whenever you need. Um. The arrow's pointing over this way. Wait a second. Uh. Supposed to go talk with. Go through Uptown and enter Haven. Uh, maybe there's a way to go over here? Maybe that's where we're supposed to be going, actually. <coughs> that's the arena, though. arena Did I go for some other way to go once I got down here is there a different door that I missed like this no I can't seem to go through there hmm I'm not sure exactly how I'm supposed to supposed to get there maybe maybe we just need to go out the, the front door the main door I guess I should say Let's just try going out that door and see where the quest thing takes us, because that's where I was thinking of going, was here to go to downtown. No, no, see, it wants us to go back in there, though. Hmm, yeah, no, it acts like the door I want's in here. All right, well, let's look around, then. I must just be missing the... Oh, yeah, uptown, this way. I'm just missing a gonna turn your back on us and join us. That's the arena. Steel yard, or maybe it's this way. That would suck if that dropped on you. Whoa. Rotary press terminal. Good luck up there with the bosses. I know you won't let us down. All right, yeah, you don't actually know, but we're here, maybe. Hurry over to Haven's kid. Go on in if you're going. Uptown. Where's up here then? Lord Asher wants a word with you. Good luck. Well, it's an empty bottle. I got tricked. Uh, I say there's a lot of a lot of fresh Nuka Colas around here. Hmm. I wonder if I'm going the wrong way. I'm just curious where this was all going. Yeah, where is this taking me? I'm guessing the wrong way. I how they just keep randomly shooting people as though they can just go out and get more people. Like, no, 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 the world's kind of collapsed. There's only so many bodies there, people. All right, let's just go back to where we were, I suppose, because I don't. I got a few Nuka Colas out of the deal, so that's that's always nice. It's like a lunch room. It's the break room. Um. Uh, Hurry over to Haven, kid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Must be here then. All right. I want to go up. Actually, no. Lord, Ash. Let's see. 
Uh, oh, he's okay. He's not anywhere nearby us. He's way over there. I don't see why Ash is wasting his time with you. What if I shoot you? Will you understand that? Wondering. It's a whole little. Hurry over to Haven, kid. I'm going. Can't pretty just calm down. Oh yeah, look at that. Got himself like a skyscraper over here. What is that statue thing? Discovered Haven. Gonna make me run between his legs, huh? I know it's gonna be. All right, here we go. Haven. Um, need to go to the. Guess I can't use the elevator, so no, no, that would be wrong then. Is this right? Yeah, it looks like it. Okay, he must be down here. Lord Asher will be right with you. Feel free to wait inside, champion. I'm telling you, I've got it covered. I'll be with you right after I maintain some order and dispense a little justice. And I suppose you'll follow that up by raising the dead. No, but I may heal the infirm later in the week. Time permitting, of course. Observe. We've had sightings of Werner back in the city, and there's been an increase in chatter between slaves. Workers. What? We call them workers. Helps with morale. Reminds them that they might earn their freedom someday. Whatever we call them, they've been gathering makeshift weapons. All right, all right. Put your guards on alert. Tell them to be on the lookout for anyone loitering too long downtown. And keep a watch on Medea at all times. Anything big happens, it's bound to go through her. Hmm. Now, I've got a very important meeting with our new friend. So if anything big comes up, you use the intercom. Yes, sir. Hmm. Okay, break's over. He's gonna see us if we go take her this I cure later. The whole new blood. Knew you couldn't be one of our normal workers. So that begs the question, who are you? And what are you doing in my city? You mean when I came in with power armor and heavily armed? You didn't suspect, huh? Um, I figure, I feel like my guy just say the bottom one. I'm the hero who's gonna kill you and free the slaves. I figured it'd be something like that. Goodbye, new blood. Hey. Oh! I got my power armor on now. Now you're gonna let me fight my way through a game. Get wrecked, Azure. Let's use this. See if we can get this desk as a little cover here. Oh! 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 There's a. Sandra, no. Next. Well, this is... So this right here was what we were planning to do, uh, you know, at the beginning. We just had to take the long way around. Asher's... Wow. T45D power armor. Luck. Charisma. Strength. Hmm. It's key, that's what we really need probably. Cure research. Watch the cure not be real. 
observational tests on isolated samples suggest the subject has a natural adaptive immunity to the so-called TROG mutation. Furthermore, it appears that this immunity carries on to other forms of radiation-induced diseases, from radiation sickness to larger mutations such as the all too common development of a sixth toe. Attempts to isolate these effects have been slow going, due in part to the delicate nature of testing. Prospects exist for uh, duplication. The unique and delicate nature of the subject requires utmost care in testing. The subject. So they have somebody they must be. What is this here? Is there something right here? I thought that was something. They must be working on somebody. Alright, um, so the question is, do we want to wear his power armor? Probably not, because it looks like I can't use these Enclave armors to repair this one. Yeah, and it's worse. Yeah, no, it's not better. It's worth 480, so maybe we'll sell it, but no, that's not worthwhile, I don't think. It's fine, which is fine, I don't think it's a problem. Yes. Um. This. Oh, that must be in 225. That's worth. That must be in great shape. Diary. We've lost karma for stealing. Oh yeah, look at that. We're just losing karma over and over again. Oh well. Like how it's considered stealing from these slaver scumbags. <laughs> like, really? Turret control system locked. Let's see if we can turn off the turrets. Not that it probably matters. Necropolis. 2 out of 10. Correct. Lifestyles. No. Because we've only got 1, 2, 3 choices left. Um... Okay, well, I kind of guessed there, but that's fine. We did. We mostly could guess it. Unlock the safe. Oh, well. Unlocked, though, but, you know. That's fine. We could have stealthed up here and stolen the stuff. I guess let's see what we got there. Test one, two. Looks like this thing is on. Marie. If you're there, this is your father speaking, Ishmael Asher, sometimes called Lord of the Pit. Now, I hope you're hearing this ten years from now, sitting on my knees safe and sound. Right about now, I bet I'm looking pretty silly. But things don't always work out the way we'd like. There are a lot of risks, including what your mother would do if she heard me talking like this. And I'm not about to risk leaving you alone without knowing where you came from. These tapes are for you. So you can know who your father really was. Hmm. Okay. Marie, the first thing you need to know is that I wasn't always the Lord of the Pit. Long before I was a king, I was a scholar and a soldier. In fact, I was in the Brotherhood of Steel. You've probably heard about them, but you may not have heard what we did to the city, the Scourge. When we came here, the pit was just a breeding ground for trogs, cannibals, and worse. The commander had us torch the place and take what we could. The pit had useful technology, but it was suicide to stay here. So when an explosion left me buried in the mill, my brothers were sure I was dead. I don't blame them for leaving. I probably would have. We thought nothing could live in the pit. We were wrong. Marie, you know those fights in the mill's arena? 
Well, its first fight was when I woke up to someone pulling me out from a pile of rubble. At first, I thought it was my brothers pulling me to safety. Instead, it was a scavenger trying to steal my armor. She didn't get it. But I learned she had a whole family of scavengers. They'd make raids into the city for gear from the mill. And that gave me an idea. This was the only working steel mill we'd ever seen. In a world of leftovers, it was a chance to build again. And that was worth any price. The scavengers saw me as a god. So along with my brotherhood know-how, it was easy to set up the basics. We started to build a city. Hmm, okay. As word of a new settlement got out, the city started growing and fast. When raiders attacked, I'd kill the leader and recruit the rest. I had to. The city's disease meant we couldn't have children. So recruiting was the only way to grow. And as we grew, the mill needed more workers. And yes, that meant recruiting workers by force. I'm not proud of it, but it's the only way to keep the city supplied and armed. But it was always a temporary solution, until our best scientists found a way to cure the city's epidemic. Sandra and I worked on it day and night. And after one particularly late night of work, we were blessed with a cure. It's the cure inside you, Marie. Even now, we're doing everything we can to figure out how to share your gift with the city. While keeping you safe, of course. So by the time you're old enough to hear this, you'll already be a hero. Congratulations, Marie. You've already saved us all. I knew you would. Okay, so his kid... I don't know, has some kind of like natural antibodies or something? Hmm. It almost sounds like maybe they haven't figured out how to like almost mass produce it yet maybe I'm not sure expecting to run into a baby somewhere now research computer oh steal the baby and leave oh yep there's a baby right there oh gosh I'm gonna steal a baby that's uh rather despicable yeah We've got karma. We're taking what whatever's not nailed down, frankly. Let's see what this research computer has on it. Baby monitor. Healthy and well. Cure research. Did we read this already? Yeah, no, we've done that. Okay, trog studies. An epidemic of the environs around the pit, which I have named Trog. Proglytic degeneration contagion appears to be the result of intense, intensely concentrated radiation. But the unique toxins and pollutants in the pit cause it to be far more pervasive. And when anyone living in the TDC active areas experience skin lesions after a few weeks of exposure. Huh. Okay. I we need to know. I guess let's take this baby. Baby Marie's uh, napping peacefully. I mean, I'd hate to say this, but we shot her family up already. Taking this baby with us. It's a terrible idea. Did we already loot you? Yeah. What are you looking at? Oh, you didn't attack me. Scram. I thought for sure they were going to attack me. What's up? Really? Alright, uh, we're just going to take this baby. Thank you. Really? No, they're not attacking us. Not interested. Alright, well, we're just gonna... We'll just take her to the... Oh, we're supposed to try to leave, I see. I mean, no one seems to be upset about this? Yeah, no, bring the baby to Medea. Well, excuse us, we're just gonna go. Oh, no, they're mad about it. Okay. There's somebody mad about it. I was gonna say, really? Nobody's mad about me doing this? Oh, hello, you too, huh? Oh, wait, no, you're a slave. Well, you're helping us. 
Okay. Oh, yeah, no, they're they're rioting right now. Phantom. Bad as Spook. Get out of here, Phantom. Well, maybe it's not as bad as Spook. Spook's pretty bad. Supervisor helmet. See, I'm supervising, he says. Uh, I don't need any of that. That's fine. Anything in there? No? Oh, you're... Okay, no, you're friendly. Never mind. Don't worry, it's just a riot. Alright, so last time... Oh! Last time, I went kind of a... I went up high and then had to go back down low to get out of here. Okay, you're a goner. Anything I need? Uh... Take that stuff. Oh wait, you're... Oh, that's a lot of guys coming. Whoa! There's that many guys coming for us. Next! Uh, there's somebody shooting at us from the ground, but, well, I'm not worried about that. Speaking of shotgun, though, that's not a bad idea. Oh! 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 Here, I need or some drugs here. I guess I could take those. I guess this is Haven. I want to. Didn't that sign? Which way do I want to go? Shoot, I'm getting turned around. I think. Let's look at our uh, local map here. I want to get to the mill there um or over here it looks like what's over here somewhere okay let's just keep going this way then um bottle cap stim pack i'll take that sure actually ah uh, it's fine i say i guess i could have taken the psycho but eh. i think i need to go down somewhere yeah down here is good All right, I think maybe, yeah, here we go, here we go. Suppose there's a riot in here going on? Yep. Hold them off, lads! Ew. You kicked the hornet's nest now, didn't you? I was lucky to get away even for a second. But more importantly, I hear you've stolen the cure. Eh, uh, it's a baby. Uh, did you know the cure's actually a baby? Of course I knew, but you don't see me blubbering about it. That baby is our only chance of a cure. It feels a little bad to steal a baby. <laughs> but if it makes you feel better, when we're done, she'll be back with her parents and never needs to know any of this happened. So quit whining. Well, that's not it, but... Uh, or whatever. I've done my part. Where is my reward? Not yet, Hotshot. Asher's got people watching me, and I can't keep a baby hidden in this dump. Werner sent me word that he's hiding out in the steel yard. He's got everything there to take care of the cure. Take it to him, and he'll handle the rest. 
Now get going. All right, find Werner in the steel yard. Well, we're already in the steel yard, so. Oh no, I guess the steel yard's this one. Oh, that's right. That's where we were before. Who's this? Brand. Nothing in here to steal. Nah. All right. Well, this is perfect. I think we'll stop right here, and then next time we'll continue with this DLC and uh, deliver a baby. <laughs> but we'll see how that goes. If you have any thoughts or comments or questions, let me know down below. And uh, if you enjoyed the video, hit that like button. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you next time.